In this video, we're going to show you a collection of mods that help transform Fallout 4 into the ultimate hunting game. From environment changes, new creatures, to more interesting gameplay mechanics. First up, we have Boston Natural Surroundings. Many mods were released over the years that transformed the wasteland into something more lush and overgrown. But this one still stands strong, and it fits the aesthetic we're looking for perfectly. With its array of pines, spruces, and new grass, the mod creates a beautiful boreal wilderness full of life. It doesn't go overboard with greenery, sticking instead to rustic tones and keeping the Commonwealth recognisable as such. Creatures will have plenty of foliage to hide in, yet can still be spotted if you pay close enough attention. Plus, this mod doesn't break precombines, so the performance impact isn't all that bad either. To give even more realism and atmosphere to the new environment, you can use the Lush Ambience mod. Birds will chirp, trees will creak, and wind can be heard through the leaves. It provides a wonderfully immersive soundscape and feels like nature is living around you. Just take a listen for yourself. Now to two incredible mods that improve hunting gameplay tremendously. With big game hunting, 32 new and law friendly creatures find their way into the Commonwealth. From ambient animals trying to avoid hungry mutants and trigger happy hunters, to heavy hitters that seek to rough you up and ruin your day. All of these come with unique drops and hand placed spawn points. This mod also adds in dozens of dynamic spawns for the new creatures as well as vanilla and DLC ones. It's truly a must-have for any hunting-themed playthroughs. With so much fascinating and immersive wildlife to hunt, every step of the game will become an adventure in its own right. Next up, to actually improve the hunting mechanics in Fallout 4, we're going to use Immersive Hunting Overhaul. This mod comes with an incredible amount of features. From skinning creatures to get their ingredients, disassembling cars and robots for parts, to keeping your knives sharp and learning new cooking recipes. For this mod list, we are especially interested in the new butchering functionalities. To collect ingredients from a killed animal or creature, you will now need a knife to be equipped. Luckily, this mod also comes with a customizable hunting knife that suits those needs perfectly. Once hitting creatures, you can choose to play a quick animation, which changes depending on the size, as well as an option to dismember them or not. All creature loot has been overhauled in an immersive way, providing a variety of new and realistic ingredients. The cooking changes and recipes are also a welcome addition, offering much more interesting meal options than vanilla. And the best part, all of this is fully compatible with the Big Game Hunting mod. All the creatures have their own unique ingredients and even more recipes become available. To still improve on these two incredible mods, consider using Wildlife Overhaul, less aggressive creatures. This mod adds aggression radius to most predators, making them warn you before they attack. It also makes prey run away in the face of danger instead of charging into their demise. Generally, creatures become less bloodthirsty and more cautious, which we definitely consider an improved and more realistic behaviour. It also randomises the height of some creatures slightly and adjusts a few stats. Be sure to download its two provided compatibility patches for both big game hunting and immersive hunting overhaul to get the full effect. And with these five mods alone, you already have a pretty substantial overhaul of the game's hunting mechanics. So now we'd like to quickly introduce a few complementary additions. Many hunting games come with some form of kill cam mechanics when you take down your targets. The closest we can get to that in Fallout 4 is with the fake kill cam mod. It comes with customization settings to adjust when and how long this effect triggers, and if the camera should zoom in on the target or just a slow-mo effect occurs. The mod is certainly a bit wonky from time to time, but it is a cool functionality nonetheless. 
With Start Me Up Redux, an updated version of the popular mod, you can free yourself from the role of a concerned parent. Through dialogue changes and alternative starts to your adventures, it allows for much more roleplay possibilities. And for our purposes, the mod includes a start that lets you begin as a hunter, that already has some useful skills and equipment. To make the game feel like a true wilderness, you might also want to use Fallout 4 76 open world. The mod comes with a holotape that lets you transform the commonwealth into an open world with all areas unlocked and no human NPCs. In this quest free land of opportunities, the wilds are only yours to explore and survive in. This makes for a much different and isolated experience since the player is completely on their own. And with no more raiders or gunners around, ammunition will also be hard to come by. You can choose to replace vendors with robots, however, giving you an incentive to sell your hunting spoils to buy necessary supplies. Since you will be spending your time out in nature and without civilization, we definitely recommend a camping mod, like Campsite Simple Wasteland Camping. It helps immersion greatly, and given that this hunting experience is best enjoyed in survival mode, it will come in handy for rest and preparation. And for our final mod, we have Commonwealth Fishing, because no game can call itself complete without a fishing feature, and it just fits into this mod list so perfectly in terms of roleplay. The mechanic is simple and comes fully animated, offering but one more way to immerse yourself in this new environment. And there you have it, a complete overhaul of Fallout 4 into a hunting-oriented game. Hopefully, you will enjoy the result as much as we did. And if you think there are any mods missing on this list, please let us know in the comments. This video is quite a bit of effort, so a like would mean lots and a comment would make our day. Thank you for watching.